Hi, your face to face with Shell. I hope everyone's doing okay out there. I know things seem to be just carrying on and on and it seems like we're, we're never getting out of this but um, hopefully not too much longer and we can start getting back to some form of normality. But in the meantime, I hope you are coping and I hope you're doing well. I want to continue with the series Comments and Stairs. The other day I was thinking about what it must be like for people who are with us, how they must feel when comments or stares are made towards anyone with an altered body image. Sorry, It must be horrible for them as well. I mean, it's terrible for the person it's happening to. But the person that's with you, they might think, First of all, oh, that this is terrible. But what what do I do? Do I say something? Do I, I just let the, the person deal with it themselves? Should I, you know, they they must think, well, what should actually should I do? And sometimes it might be even a bit embarrassed because thinking, oh no, I'm in a situation I have no idea how to handle this. I feel terrible for the person it's happening to. They maybe feel angry towards the person who's doing it, but they just don't have a clue how to handle the situation. And it 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 must be horrible. It really must be just not knowing. Oh, oh, what what do I do here? What do I do for the best? Because as I've said before, you don't want situations to escalate, which they can do. You just never know how. If you say something, you just don't know how how it's going to turn out. Um, but the other person might feel, do you know what, I, I want to say something because this is like right out of order here. And sometimes, as I've said before, people need to be made aware of their comments and actions. And again, it'll just be how you feel in the day, how that person feels in the day. And it'll just depend on how they, they react and how you react. Then on the other side, sometimes things will happen and it's happened to me before. Someone said really something really quite terrible and I look around and I think, what, is nobody else going to say anything here? <laughs> so it's a fine line um, and you never know how you or anybody else is going to feel. If you are with someone a lot of the time, it's maybe a good idea to discuss with them maybe something has happened so you could discuss later on and say well, what did you think about that how do you think we should have handled it did we handle it right and then discuss with them if they feel comfortable in speaking up for you if you feel comfortable with them speaking up with you for you sorry i think it's it's quite good as always talk about things um and then the other person could tell you their feelings and then it might not be such a big deal or, or awkward when another situation arises. Also, if you've not been with someone for a while or they've never been with you, maybe it's a good idea to maybe, you know, let them know, look, something might happen, I'm, I'm not wanting it to, but just in case, and how might we handle it? And this, of course will be if you're comfortable speaking to this person about it. But I think especially if you're with someone who you go out with a lot, I think it's a good idea. Maybe have a, a bit chat and see, what, what do you think we should do? Well, you know, how should we handle the situation? I just thought I would talk to you about that because there's something that came to mind and it's, it's on the, the flip side of what I've been talking about, how other people might feel when, when they're with you. Thank you once again for watching. It really is amazing and thank you. It really, really means a lot to me. As I've said before, I really want to get this message out to as many people that need it, that they're not alone and there are other people out there who have gone through and are going through the same things as, as them. Remember, I do have a website and I'll put a link in the description to the video so you can head over there where there's lots more help, photographs, if you're not already subscribed, it would be awesome if you could subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos. 
a massive shout out to my subscribers. Thank you so, so much. You can also give me a like, a thumbs up and a share. Again, thank you once again. It really, really means a lot to me. Stay safe, stay strong and we'll chat soon. Bye.